Hello guys, it's Stacy and welcome back to my channel. So today was actually my third day of school and since I already obtained all my syllabi, I think it's syllabi. It is syllabi, right? I I'm just going to say syllabi because it sounds right-ish. So I already have all my syllabi that I got from my teachers, so I know what they want. So basically after I finally knew what they wanted me to get for the school year, I decided to film a school supplies haul because I went on a little shopping spree for school supplies and if you know me as a person, I personally love school supplies and stationery. Like, leave a comment below if you are also the same. I think the main reason why is because I like functional things and I like cute things. So when you put those two together, like, magic. <laughs> so I'm just going to show you guys what I got from a couple places. And yeah, this will probably be my last, like, back to school video just because I'm pretty sure a lot of people have already started school so let's get started so the first store I went to was Walmart so I got four binders from there and I actually used these binders in eighth grade and I really liked them so I decided to buy them again and thankfully I found them so I got a bunch of different colors but the first one I got is this blue and it's sparkly as you can see and I'm gonna be honest here these look so gorgeous when you shine light on them maybe I can see if I can do it for you right now it's really hard to show this on camera I don't can you see it I look really stupid right now, but okay. Um, but yeah, it looks so gorgeous in light. So I think that this will definitely motivate me for my schoolwork and stuff like that. I'm not sure if I told you guys. I totally forgot, but just in case. Um, I go to a school where we have block schedule and we have blue days and gold days. So periods one, two, and three are on blue days. And so I got this blue binder so that I can do blue day. I got a gold one and this is just as gorgeous as all the other ones but I personally love the color gold and because it's gold day this is pretty fitting so I was so happy when I found this. Also if you do go to your Walmart and you cannot find all the colors that I'm showing you guys like try to look behind the binders that's what I did it was like literally a mini scavenger hunt and that just made the whole experience actually more fun when I found all the colors that I wanted. I got the silver one and this is actually the same exact binder that I got in 8th grade except the funny thing was that I got this for $2.97 and in 8th grade which is 3 years ago I got it for $3.97 so that was a pretty good deal and then I found this super super cute like magenta colored one um, it looks more purple. There's actually a color that was like a deeper purple, but I decided to get this one because it has like specks of pink and purple in it. So those are actually my two favorite colors. So this was a good fit for me. So next stop is Staples. And I got like a couple things from here, but they were at different times. I actually still need to get filler paper from there but I kind of just forgot so anyways I got this three subject notebook I already used it as you can see the what do you call this the cardboard label on it is not there anymore um, but mainly because I had a summer assignment I need to do in here so I have this and I always like to get the light blue because it looks really pretty I like going to Staples mainly because they have a bunch of notebooks but they're always super cheap but pretty good quality so I got these two. I mainly got these because of the colors. This purple one, which is, I already told you, my favorite color. And then I got this like hot pink one. These are both um, cardboard covers, so they do rip easily. But I guess I can just use this for like classes that um, I don't really care that much about. Like maybe like conservatory. If you guys don't know what conservatory is, go check out this video because... I will tell you what conservatory is at my school. Then I got these notebooks and these are actually my favorite notebooks that I like to buy every year. So basically they are these like, I think they call these like poly covers, but they're like this like plastic cover and these 
let me tell you, these are a lifesaver because by the end of the school year, these cardboard notebooks always rip and they look just really bad. But these will never rip on you. And they are super durable and for the price, I think I got these for one dollar each i'm not sure but they were super cheap um so i definitely recommend these they're just a few cents more expensive than the cardboard ones but they hold up a lot better during the school year i don't think i need this many notebooks for all my classes but it's always good to get extra just in case you just need one in the middle of the school year next up is target and i bought just a little bit of stuff here so the first thing I got were these tabs um, they're like plastic and they're clear and they have pockets I actually usually get the Avery ones but those are slightly more expensive these were four dollars those were eight dollars so I decided to get these and these are actually not that bad I actually started using them today in my blue day binder as you can see right here and yeah Oh yeah guys, I put Cookie and the rest of the crew right here just so that I can remind myself to um, stay motivated in school, you know? Other than getting these two, I got a planner. I already started using this because school year already started. I need to start writing things down. got this beautiful neon coral and it's super bright and this just reminds me to do stuff and stay on task because it's so bright that like when I see it out of the corner of my eye like it just screams like you need to do stuff right now so anyways when you open it up it's like this polka dotted reflective color and the same thing on this page it says agenda this is just um a planner for July 2016 to June 2017 and I put a little Daiso marker right here, it's a frog, <laughs> to mark my place. But this is by the brand Sugar Paper and their collaboration with um, Target. So yeah, I really like this a lot. This was actually kind of like an impulse buy, but I was just walking by the back to school section and I saw this. It's this USB flash drive and it is 32 gigabytes, which is crazy because you know, iPhones used to be 32 gigabytes and this was only $6, which I was like shocked because I thought that usually flash drives are a lot more expensive. And plus this has such big capacity that I was just like, I'm gonna get this. So I got that. And the last thing that I got from Target was this folder. It is purple and it kind of like matches my backpack color. It's by Five Star. It's a two pocket folder. I've actually never seen this design before so I was really intrigued by it. So when you open it up, I already have some papers in here, but it has like these little things that will help keep your papers in place and I've just put some like line paper there. And then there's also like tabs which is so cool. You can keep even more organized. And there's this little pocket for index cards. I actually... I put Chim Chim in here because um yeah. So I just basically wanted a folder where I could keep all my homework and stuff together as I said in a previous video like I like to do my homework even if it's for a different day so I can just bring this with me to school without the bulk of my whole other binder. So the next few things are more writing utensils and the first store I went to was Daiso. I went here over the summer actually and I just decided to pick up some school supplies a little bit early so I got this pencil case. I'm gonna be honest here, I bought this planner also to go with my pencil case. It says love question mark with a little heart on the bottom which I thought was super cute. The next few items are already in my pencil case. This is actually not new but I decided to use my old one that I've been using for the past two years I think. Um, it's by Muji. I got a couple of highlighters from Daiso because a lot of mine were drying out and I got these like scented ones. I got these like scented highlighters. I think there's like two more. I just can't find them in there right now. But um, yeah, this one smells like strawberry. This one smells like banana and this one smells like grape. I actually really like these a lot because today I was using them for like highlighting and stuff. Obviously, that's what you do with a highlighter. So I was using these today and like I was using the yellow one and all of a sudden I was like smelling banana and I was really confused until I looked down 
I realized I was highlighting with a banana marker, so. Yeah, it was a weird experience. And you guys know that I really like the brand Muji. So the last few items I got, I actually got during like the last part of um, the school year before you know when I was a sophomore I got these Muji pens these I actually asked my relatives from Taiwan to help me buy and send them over here I got these like marker pens you know those like paper mate flare pens I think they're called um, these are kind of like what they are but the best thing about these is that these have like a thick end and a Thin, end. thin for like if you want to write stuff like just everyday use and then a thick side for maybe like coloring or if you want to do like bold lettering that's what I'll use it for and I actually have like a whole set of them but I just decided to get the colors that I use the most frequently I got these two pencils and with these they're not really anything special but I just like the look of them because they're clear they're like all clear and they are 0.5 thickness which is like my preferred thickness so I thought that I'd get two more of these I actually used one of these last year um, and I really like them so I decided to get two more and these are just like retractable gel pens but let me tell you Muji gel pens are literally the bomb.com. Who uses that phrase anymore? I don't know. Such a grandma. So I got these colors. Um, I actually wanted the whole pack, but then I realized I should just get the colors. Why do I always drop things in videos? This is so weird. Okay. So I actually really like Muji gel pens. Like Muji gel pens are so cool. And I love these colors specifically. Uh, these are like a neon purple and then like a blue, a light blue, and then this pink, but it's like more of a dark pink. They write so well and they're really good for using them to take notes because I suggest using colorful pens to take notes. That way you will be able to memorize it a lot more. I actually have two more school supplies for you guys to see. <laughs> Um, and I actually bought these super recently. Technically, shoes are a school supply, right? I mean, you have to walk in between classes and my campus is so huge. We have three buildings. One of the buildings, you have to go up seven flights of stairs. So anyways, I'm just gonna say, shoes are a necessity, technically, for school. So this purchase was probably the purchase that was honestly the best thing for back to school for me. Um, it's these white high top Converse. They are just totally white. Um, and these are actually the Chuck Taylor All-Star 2, which has like the Lunar Lawn um, insole because, you know, Nike bought Converse. I basically got these because I've been wanting high top Converse for literally the longest time ever. Probably I would say five years, like that's how long. But I could never get myself to buy them just because like I would always tell myself like $55 for high tops. Like I really want them, but a lot of people said that their feet were hurting and like they wear out like really quickly. So I was like, it's not really worth it if you're gonna spend like $55 and then in the end they're gonna like break down and stuff. But when Converse released the Chuck Taylor 2, I was actually thinking about it and thinking about getting these because these are like the new and improved um, high top Converse. So I actually wore these one time already, actually on the first day of school. And yeah, I can definitely see that these are super comfortable. They feel just like my free runs. I think mainly because they both have the lunar lawn in them but the padded tongue is like really great too because my socks don't reach all the way up to my ankles. These also come with black laces. Um, so actually I think when you're ordering the Converse All-Star 2, you get two sets of laces. I think usually you get like the color of your shoe and then maybe like a black or a white option. I'm usually like a 7 or 7.5 in um, maybe like boots or sneakers so I got a 7.5 and they fit totally fine it came in this box usually like at least right now they're $80 but on the Nike website just like for one week for one magical week they were $64 in which these high tops never go on sale okay 
but they were just magically like $64. Also, let us not forget that, um, Partially the reason, I swear, I promise, okay? I promise that was just partially the reason. I was super happy about this, like you don't understand. I don't even understand how these, just like one pair of just sneakers could make me so happy, but they do. So I was really excited about this. These are also like high top sneakers, but these are from Nike. Yes, they look like this. Um, I actually went to, what was it? Where did I get this? I went to Bloomingdale's and they were having a sale. These were originally, I think, $90, uh, but they were on the sale rack and I was looking at it and it was like an extra 25% off, I think. Um, and at first when I saw these, I was like, they really remind me of those, um, the Vans, the Vans um, skater shoes. I don't know if like I'll, I'll put a picture right here somewhere somewhere on the screen i'll put a picture of the vans kind but they really remind me of those um except there's a white nike swoosh they have this like textured little and then they have white laces and they're actually pretty comfortable the tongue is just like really thin and all around it's really just like a mesh so i guess it's like good breathability and on the back it just says nike it's like a leather i haven't worn these yet but hold up funny story about these <laughs> while i was completing my summer assignments i was listening to just one day um by bts and i was actually listening to the instrumental then all of a sudden my screen was still like on the video but since the video was like an instrumental um it was like fan made so they were there were just like pictures of them and i realized i had the same sneakers as the ones they wore in the mv but yeah i'll put a picture right here to show you guys what i mean but yeah i didn't even know they had the same sneakers as me until now or until after i bought these so i was like it's a sign I'm actually more pumped about these after watching that video <laughs> um, because, I don't know, maybe one day we will be couple twinning from opposite sides of the earth. Okay, so that is the end of my school supplies haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. In my mind right now, um, there's not that much stuff. But there, maybe this video was pretty long just because I wanted to get to talk to you guys and just, you know, hang out with you guys over the internet. <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. As always, please give it a thumbs up <laughs> just because it's free and it will make me really happy. Subscribe down below to get notifications on when I upload. Um, I will try my best to upload during junior year even though i'm taking three ap's right now it's gonna be hard but hopefully i'll be able to fit this in my schedule even though once i get back like literally the sky is all dark and it's really hard to film um but yeah i'll try i'll try, I'll try my best for you guys so i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye <sighs>
might film a tutorial on this because I really liked it. Like recently, I don't know why, but I've been like experimenting with different makeup looks just because. Like it's actually pretty fun when you're getting ready in the morning because like you can be like, oh, I can have a different look today. But yeah, do you like it? I like it. I think that will be my next video. Stay tuned to watch. What am I, what am I face with this wall? Oh my God, that'd be so scary. Everybody say no. kind of hyper right now, mainly because I had a caramel macchiato in the morning. Yeah, the caffeine's not wearing off yet. Okay, bye! <laughs>